<laughs> what is the where's the irony in that? There's lots of irony in that. Hey, God damn it! I really need to get food so that I can run for longer than like 12 inches. It's like I'm running and I'm done, and I'm running and I'm done. There's no, there's no distance there, you know. All right, we're going up here. There's got to be some bamboo somewhere. Oh yeah, one thing I did in the first game was I made the thumbnail accurate to who I was playing as. I'm not going to bother with that because there are going to be too many episodes where I play as multiple people. And I'm just going to like sort of do a systematic thumbnail system where, you know, I just go in order and then I come back around and loop. Yeah, bamboo! Pallet upgrade! Hell yeah! Too bad I don't have a pickaxe because I can't even get that clay. I guess I'd have to get lucky enough to get some clay drops from these jerks. Hey, jerks, I'm talking about you guys. You guys want to drop some clay? I mean, your bodies are made of clay. You should drop some clay so that I can get pallet upgrades. Get another pallet. This is, what can I do with this vacuum? There's got to be something I can do with this vacuum. All right, I'm on the lookout for scrap iron and coconuts so that I can get more blue points. How many did I need? Uh, oh, I have enough scrap iron. I just need two blue points, which I can get from coconuts. Oh, damn it. Well, coconuts are the best thing to use right now. Actually, bitter grass is better than the coconuts. And... Yeah, okay. Nope, never mind. I was wrong. Coconuts are the best thing to use right now. Come on, transform! I said transform! You assholes! There. I win. I got a bunch of medical herbs. Damn it. Alright, fine. What's over here? Oh, this is where I started out as Luffy. Yeah, I'm kind of limited on where I could go at the exact moment of right now because I, uh... I don't have any friggin' points. Who has the most SP? Just, who has the most SP? I can't even change the display. Alright, I just have to eyeball it. I think it's Chopper. Again, Chopper has the most SP. So he's gonna be the fastest, farthest runner. Ah! Can he do anything? No, he still has that little twiddly stick arm stab or whatever that is. Just swing your stupid little arm. Dumbass! This does nothing! Alright, screw this. Um... I guess we'll play with Sanji for a bit. Oh, he has less SP, but whatever. I need coconuts. That's what I need. Hey! Here's some coconuts. Oh, good. You transformed. Ugh! Die! Alright. There were plenty of trees back here, so there should be plenty of coconuts. Coconuts are the best thing for blue points right now! Ha ha ha! Ah! Go! Give me that scrap iron. I'm gonna need that for building stuff later. Ha <laughs> ha! Now you die. Yeah! Ah! Ow! Yeah, if coconuts land on you. They actually drain your SP. Ow! I wonder if I can get it to bounce three times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh! Record breaking. All right. Is that enough? Can I can I get two blue points, please? Two blue points. That's all I need. Ah, damn it! All right, fine. I'll use my medical herbs, you jerks. Damn it. Okay, that's cool. As long as I can get past this next area. God damn it! All right, yeah, for real. I need to I need to get those keys made. Unlock those doors. Start cooking, start making, start developing as both Usopp and Frankie so I can build some super cool weapons and super cool items and other stuff like that. But it all starts here on this humble little island where I have nothing again! Just like the goddamn unlimited adventure game. What are you gonna do? You gonna blow up the rock? Oh. Whoa, he hit the sunny! 
Oh no, he activated the lion cannon! Lions roar cannon! Alright. That was actually pretty cool. So he doesn't actually he doesn't actually personally take down the obstacles. He just, you know, makes the right conditions to where the obstacles he's taking down. He doesn't care how it happens as long as it happens. That's pretty much what I'm trying to say here. And uh what have, what have, what have, what have, what, have, what have we opened? Where are we now? There's a frog. I want that frog. Ah, hey, look at the look at the Look at the little froggy! Oh, he's adorable. He'll make a great stew. I'll fucking cook him! Because I'm Sanji! And I cook things! Like fucking Walter White! Ah! Ah! Die like the rest! Give me that scrap iron. I'm gonna need it for stuff. I don't know what yet. Alright, so... Unlimited Adventure? I beat like eight times before I recorded it. This game I've only beaten once, and it was it was recently too. Not 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 so recently, but more recently than um, Unlimited Adventure. So I'm going to be a little less um, knowledgeable. Is the word? I'm going to be less effective. I'm going to be um, less prepared, possibly, for certain things. All right, what do we got here? Some kind of weird, crazy-ass plant thing straight out of Legend of Zelda, looks like. Looks like a Deku Baba. But it is the boss spawner, I guess. No more crazy stone monuments with crystals on top. No, we got freaky plants with evil seeds of monsters. So who's our first boss? Who is it? Who is it? Who is it? Oh my god! It's Bartholomew Kuma! Oh, oh shit. Oh no! Yeah, this is a hell of a first boss. I am a paw pad man. I have the ability of the paw paw fruit. You guys act so surprised. You've seen him. <laughs> yeah, this guy showed up right at the end of Thriller Bark. Right. Oh, goddamn! Yeah, he has instant transmission bullshit powers. He's also our first boss, so even though he does look very evil and powerful, and he is very powerful in the show. I don't think he's gonna be so powerful right now. Oh, fuck me! Yeah, he has the paw, he has the paw pad fruit, whatever the fuck he called it. Um, basically, he can repel anything, alright? He can repel anything, even the air, which is how he tre which is how he teleports. He can also defend against any attack with his bullshit paw pad powers. But, you know, I've got... Oh! New move! Oh, don't die, I want to use this. Oh, yeah, party table. Party table kick course. Alright, Sanji is fucking carving a way forward with his party table kicks. Uh-oh. Yep, he's pissed off now, so he's going to start using his special moves. Oh, no. Paw cannon. No, you fucking don't! Oh! Alright, can I break him? Nope, alright, dodge the paw cannon. Alright, cool. Break! No! Okay, cool, I rolled. So I got my combo still. Let me heal up a bit while he does his stupid little move. Right. Ha! Damn it! Haha, I saw it through your fucking little thing! You little bitch! Yeah! He is almost dead! Oh, shit! That wasn't gonna work on me, dude! I wasn't even attacking you! Oh, I fucking attacked him like an idiot! Uh-oh! No, no, no! No! I'm cool. I'm alive. 
Ah, fuck me! Where's the shock? Run, 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 run! I couldn't run away! Who will finish this fight? I guess Usopp will. I just randomly picked. Ah! Fuck you! Damn it! Fuck you! No! Oh! Die! Usopp, you're not... You're not equipped for this fight at all. Okay, screw this. Whoa! All right, yeah, for real, screw this. I wasn't even attacking you. I was switching. God damn! Give me a break. Where's, where's, yeah, where's Zoro? He can handle this. Ah, ah, ah! Run away! No! Damn it! Die, die, die! You little bastard! Shit! Probably going to be a while before anybody gets a special move. Ah, ah. Stay behind him. And you're dead! Aw. Yay! He's dead! I did it. Bartholomew Akuma, the first boss, defeated. What do I get? A crazy flesh colored orb! Okay, he's gonna eat it! Alright! <gasps> Treasure! Hell yeah! I want the treasure! Yeah, he wasn't even trying. That was pretty easy. No one even died. Except for Sanji. Hey, look, treasure! Hell yeah, treasure! So that's the ordeals, huh? Just bosses? Sanji, <laughs> bastard! He probably start spitting up treasure, Sanji, huh? How's that? Uh, you tell me how that works out for you. Can we just thank you? Open the damn treasure chest. Ooh, a green orb! Ooh, green orbs. I'm gonna throw it away. No, I'm not. So the green orbs basically are, um, I don't think you can use them for anything. I think they're just for converting into points of the, um, corresponding color. But you know what? I'm going to hold on to it. I'm actually going to do a little bit of research between this recording session and the next recording session to see if I can use those green orbs for anything other than converting points. If I decide, or if I, if the research pulls up that there is no other point to it, just converting points, then I'm going to use them to convert points. But, watch me find out that there's like some super secret thing where, you know, if you collect all the orbs, you could use them for some awesome thing like a secret boss. Holy crap, this is a new enemy that we did not see before. It's, um, God's Enforcers from Skypia, Right? Oh, map fragment. Cool. So yeah, we're not just dealing with... Alright. Let's see here. In the first game, Unlimited Adventure, we fought three factions of enemies. We fought the pirates. We fought the marines. Oh, I'm sorry. The navy. And we fought the robots towards the end. This game kind of brings together a whole bunch of factions. I mean, we're going to be fighting uh, Enel's Sky... Enforcers, we're gonna be fighting the White Berets, we're gonna be fighting the Clay Monsters, we're gonna be fighting the Zombies, I think, and we're gonna be fighting the Pirates and the Marines and the Robots eventually. Some other faction, I think, is thrown into the mix, I'm not quite sure. That might be the second part of Unlimited Cruise, but we'll find out. I think Baroque Works shows up eventually. I'm just trying to remember where. Hey, it's Rubber Fruit! <laughs> Woo! The Super Sling Shot. I need Rubber Fruit. Aw, oh, man, are you, t are you telling me you want me to go all the way back to the Sunny Go to make something right now? Alright, you know what? Screw that. We're gonna go as far as we can go. 
Actually, you know what? No, it's probably best to uh, just go back to the Sunny Go like it wants me to. Do a quick save. Come back. Start exploring again. God damn it. It sucks that I can't run. Ah! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Go. Yeah, for real. I need to, I need to like, get... I need to get... Um, I need to get the ability to make food so that I can increase everybody's fancy dancy stats, like health and SP. All right, back to the sunny. What is with this boat? That's one thing. I mean, why this boat? This isn't even a boat. This is just like a little tiny dinghy. If you're going to make a trip away from the sunny go, use the mini Mary. All right, we're back to the sunny. And we're gonna make that thing. Um, yeah, we'll make one. Frankie and Chopper, I mean Frankie and Usopp, working together to make some super thing. Woo! Rubber strap that flings people back to the ship, attached to certain landscape features. All right, yeah, we're going to be making a whole lot of these. These kind of act as checkpoints. Ooh, sweet! Now I can make more stuff. Yep, Usopp's pretty much explaining it right now. Yeah, and look at all the stuff we unlocked. We need a beetle. Uh, what is that? A dial? A fragment of a dial. Fragment of a dial. Uh, sweet liquid. Probably nectar. A piece of wood. Probably a piece of wood. Alright. Nothing else we can make, so let's pop a quick save on this. No! You bitches, quit gossiping! No, oh, you assholes, I wanna save! I wanna save! I guess I have to talk to the desk and not Nami herself. Alright, save complete! Uh, no, let's not go back to the main menu. But let's take a quick break so I can check all the recording stuff and make sure everything's turning out just okay. We'll be right back with more One Piece Unlimited Cruise.